Okay, so I'm pretty well there. I'm about 75% there. Even put up my lighting <laughs> for mood. <clears throat> I got a little DMX controller here. Um, but um, this is it. So uh, aside from my range of guitars and MIDI stuff, live stuff, uh, with the mixer and got tons and tons of pedals <laughs> that anybody could possibly want. Um, got the server going. This QNAP server is awesome. You should always have a QNAP server. These things are just great. I'm going to play around with this guy later on, this new pedal, uh, which is very cool from what I've seen. And um, I'm using the Bose for my playback for now. I'll put a big 36-inch monitor in here uh, come Tuesday when it arrives. But for now, it's um, I'm real happy with the uh, the Behringer uh, user user interface. Um, you know the control surface; it works really well. And of course, I use my little audio box to uh, get stuff in there. Um, I've got a tube MP3 as well that uh, I'll stack on top of there, and I've got another ART um, mastering device that's coming in soon. I've got plenty of amps uh, for all kinds of different things um, for in studio use. Aside from all the modeling and stuff you do, the only, I got to get rid of these stupid ass cables because right now there's a lot of noise. In the line, I'm pretty sure it's from using this big jumble of cables that I usually <clears throat> use in a live situation with the powered PA. Um, so I have to get rid of that, reduce the noise. Um, I don't know, not sure what I do with my line, my power and line conditioner, but I cannot find it. I'm sure I'm going to need one because this is an older house and it just does not provide very clean power, unfortunately. Yeehaw. What's <laughs> a nice lighting to create mood. And, you know, it's just, it's a nice backyard. It's really pretty. Really pretty. So, looking forward to putting this space to good use. Um, hope to get you something soon.